So hey guys, how's it going? I'm doing okay. I'm obviously back from Katsukon. I actually didn't film any on Sunday. It was kind of like a lazy, chill day. We just kind of went to the art sally, went to the dealer's room, sat around and talked, enjoyed some gaming and stuff, because um, my friend fell in love with this game called Channel A, and boy, is it super fun. We might, maybe we will record, like, a session of us just playing Channel A because it's really fun. Alright, so, basically what this video is about is, I figured since, you know, I got a good bit of stuff at this convention, well, a good bit for me, that I'd share it with you, because, you know, the past couple of years, financially, I haven't really been doing well, but I had a lot of generous people helping me this year, so I was able to get some stuff. Now, it's not a huge collection of stuff, but, again, it's more than what I'm used to getting, so... Let's start. Um, the first thing I got, which was my biggest purchase, was this Zerg shirt. Um, try to point it at my shirt. It's covered in cat hair right now. Um, but, yeah, it's a Zerg shirt <laughs> from, you know, StarCraft. And then the first thing I ever bought was this. Um, it's the little cake I had in the um, video I did with John. Um, it's from No Flutter on DeviantArt. She does, like, these really awesome custom top hats and stuff, but, um, I was able to actually be able to get something for pretty cheap at, um, her table, which made me happy because I didn't think I'd be able to afford anything at her table at all. Alright, and then I got these. It's you know, Fox things, memo pad, and I think this is either a sticker or a magnet, because the back is black, but I think it's a sticker, I think. Um, I just haven't opened it yet. Um, originally, there was, like, a really big Fox pillow at this, uh, table, and I wanted it really bad, but by the time I got back to it, it was gone, so I got what remaining Fox things there were. Um, there was also a table in the dealer's room that was selling just random dice, like, it had so much dice you could just pick out cheap dice, so I got two D20s and a D6, because my D20s have been really mean to me lately, but yeah. This one's got purple and green, this one's acid green, and then this one's got blue and red. And let me tell you, sitting on a dice, on a die, hurts a lot. Because I was like, I sat everything on my bed, and I was like, where's the green die? And then I, I turned, and I was like, ow, I think I found it. Alright, so... These are the Valentine cards that I got from random people. Like, if I, when I just dressed as Homestuck, people gave me these. Um, and that made me really happy. I wanted to hand out cards, too, and completely forgot to do it. So, you know, and it's cool because their um, they're Tumblr URLs are on there. So I can, like, totally add them, and I'm so excited about that. And then um, a lot of the people that I knew last year were there. So I didn't have to get secondary business cards, but um, I did get some business cards. And here are the ones I got. This person makes amazing hats. Like, I, I've i wanted their hats for, like, two years and couldn't figure out, like, you know, which one I wanted. They're MD Mad Hatters, or MD Hatters, Mother and Daughter Hatters. Um, it's, if you want to be able to contact them, um www.etsy.com slash shop slash MD Hatters. And then this is No Flutters card. She's got a deviant art. Um, this girl um, had Homestuck prints, but she was giving them away free with like other purchases, and I got one of her prints. And yeah, let me see if I can get it to actually focus. Focus. Her name is basically Mayuki. Mayuki. M A Y U I K I, and she has a deviant art. And then there's this one. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the print. Just um, hold on for a second, because I'm obviously not as prepared as I wanted to be. But yeah, um, she was super happy whenever I got the print because it was an original design, and um. I guess she didn't expect anybody to get it, but I freaking loved it, so. Here it is. I'm going to put it up on my wall, and it's going to be awesome. So, yeah. 
there's that. Alright, so, um, the MD Hatters company, I was able to finally pick out a hat that I wanted from them. Um, I owe my friend some money for it, but <laughs> it was totally worth it. Totally worth it. So, oh, uh, show it to you guys. Okay, it's a bunny hat with a BMO. Yeah, and it's really comfortable. So, yeah. And then my friend was like, I really want to get you a gift. Is there anything that you want that's super expensive and you can't afford? And I was like, there is one thing. And it's a thing I've been wanting for years, and there was a perfect one. Like, there was minor details I didn't like, but there was a perfect one of this thing at the convention, and I, like, cried. So, ready? Ta-da! I have a Keyblade, finally. And I am so excited about it. I was, like, the happiest person in the world whenever... I finally got it. Um, my friend wants me to do a video of me swinging it around. And I will, probably, eventually. I just want to make sure I don't break everything, because I told him that was going to be the result. I was going to injure myself and break everything in my room. So, awkward. <laughs> but yeah. So that's what I got at the convention, and it was really fun. And I'm really happy to have gotten the chance to get all that awesome stuff and be able to contact those peoples and still get to see their awesome work. So, yeah. I hope you guys have a really, really good day, and I will talk to you later. Bye!